up. <laughs> Get some food. I'm alive. I'm awake. We're gonna hit the gym. But before that, we're gonna get extremely good laksa. Okay, the cool thing about Singapore is they're all tech savvy. So they actually asked me to use the tech in my credit card, like the pay to tap the pay and whatever, pay wave stuff. But we're eating laksa. This is like traditional food. We gotta go to an ADM. We have arrived. Such a cute place. He is a popular man. Hello. Two small laxes for us. Ten dollars. Perfect. Okay. Can we have no fresh lime juice? No. Does that look really good and authentic? What? Good. It's so good. It's really spicy, but it's really good. It's super tasty. So I'm back on the counter, I need extra lime juice and he's laughing at me. <laughs> the laksa is extremely spicy but extremely good. Oh, okay. Back here, round two. We found a gym. We ate, now we gym. We just got out of the gym and now we're grocery shopping because we don't want to spend. We had dinner last night and it was very, very expensive. Eggs, some peanut butter, and we're looking for milk and yogurt. Milk and yogurt? We decided we're just gonna buy here because it saves us around 80%, that much. So if out, we, we spend like 15, 10 to $15 a meal. Here it's 10 to $15 a day. We gotta measure our bananas. Okay, fruit, banana. Back at home, it's 400. Okay. Um, oh, and then I got blueberries. The fruits are cheap. I wouldn't know. I don't buy fruits at home. We Filipinos are deprived of good and cheap berries. Like I always say, it's always a, an experience grocery shopping abroad. You always see the cool stuff they sell. Right? Yes. Like cheap fruits. Cheap berries. I'm sure the bananas are expensive though, no? I'm pretty sure we have cheap bananas. So my friend Mando is making me stay in this place for free. Obviously, which is saving me a lot of money. So the least I can do is be a nice guest. And since so he doesn't have a cleaner, I can do it for him. So <laughs> <laughs> I actually got started here a while ago and you are a filthy, filthy man. That's three tiles worth of dust. Okay, now shoot. I gotta sweep the floor. 
I'm done with my work. I just finished sweeping the whole unit. Look at all that gunk. Cleaning done. Food cooked. Let's eat. You put cheese in it. Put a bit of milk. Is that it? Not bad. Midnight Express approves the first time. <laughs> We're gonna eat. We're hungry. This is, what is this place? Wantosek. Wantosek. So we plan on picking out here. Dim sum to the max. So if any of you guys understand, uh, these are our orders. This is Maria, Miss Singapore 2013, coolest person in Singapore. Oh, so when you go here, you gotta meet her. If not, come find me. It's just useless going to Singapore. And of course, partner in crime would be Nisa. Also cool as hell. You could be mistaken as Filipino. The grub has arrived. <laughs> Mando just said that anything you eat here has to be dipped in this sauce because it's dirty. Dirty is dirty. Is good. Dirty is good. <laughs> Our work here is very much done. It's time to go home and sleep. Good night. We're finally home. We're finally home. We're home. What the f with the video? No. We're home. <laughs> Manda thinks we have a surprise for we him. Don't we don't surprise. at all. You weirdo. Okay. Okay. Something is wrong. See, there's nothing wrong. Banana. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> Mine is afraid of bananas. No, I'm okay, I'm okay. And we I'm have bananas okay. here. You guys can eat. It, it was such a good night. Bye. Good place.